near the vacation destination of Myrtle Beach on South Carolina's beautiful Atlantic coast. One might not expect to find among the resorts homeless veterans in desperate need of help. Even more surprising and heartwarming is the brainchild of Vietnam combat veteran Chris Tortolot, director of the Veterans Welcome Home and Resource Center. Chris also operates Hutton House, where veterans can find temporary housing while they get back on their feet. Even though we live in an affluent area, there's still many veterans out there trying to reintegrate back in society that are struggling and we have built this facility to meet their needs to help them get back into where they belong. The facility is serving as a stepping stone for veterans who wish to work, stay sober, and get back on their feet. We recognize one of the biggest needs was a place for veterans to stay while they're reintegrating back in society. Therefore, we built a Hutton House which holds up to eight veterans. Their story captured the interest of members from the local American Legion Auxiliary Unit. As a member of the American Legion Auxiliary Unit 186 in Little River, I've come to know many people who work with our veterans in this area. I met Chris Turtlet, who runs a terrific program here, and one day I asked him, how could the auxiliary help? Preparing veterans to find a job is their main mission and where the facility desperately needed help. There came a point while we were preparing the house to house veterans that we needed two computer stations for the veterans to utilize for web search and job search. And to the rescue, the American Legion Auxiliary. I thought about a video that I had seen last year's national convention about the American Legion Auxiliary Foundation grant. I found the application online and it was easier than applying for a courtesy card at the grocery store. Most people think of a grant application as lots of paperwork, but this grant really isn't. Within one month from the time the application was submitted, we had the money. Chris was so excited when I called him and told him that we had gotten the grant and we could go shopping. It was like a kid on Christmas morning to see his face as we shopped. Now that we have the computers here, the veterans are able to do a 24-7 search for their jobs, continue to work on their program, and even veterans are coming in off the street that are looking for jobs, they're able to utilize them at their convenience. We were able to purchase two of these workstations with the Foundation Grant. As a veteran who struggled himself, we greatly appreciate when organizations step up to help. We want to thank the American Legion Auxiliary Foundation for the generous donation to the Hutton House. To learn more about how your unit and department can apply for a foundation grant or donate, visit alaforveterans.org and look for the ALA Foundation link. Find a need, come up with an idea to help, apply for a grant, and witness something great.